Shannon Lilly for the Pro Tour and Adequan USDA Gold Cup Series at Aspen Farms. And I'm standing with the two leaders, first and second place riders from the advanced division today. First place was Jordan Linsett aboard Revitavet Capato. Mm -hmm. And second place rider, Jill Walton aboard DD Chaser. So I'm going to ask both of you. I'll start with Jill, second place rider. How did you feel about your test today? It was the best that she's been for me. She, well, I nailed one of my changes and one of my walk pirouettes, and she was just the best she's been in the ring for me. Oh, really? And I made mistakes and got rewarded and got corrected, and I thought it was very well judged. Good, good. And what about, how long have you been riding this course? I've been riding her since January. Okay. So this is my fifth or sixth event. So okay. I'm a little nervous about tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> but I had a great time today. Well, good. And how, Jordan, how did you feel about your test? Uh, my test... It was good. It was his uh, his first advance. He's done a couple two stars, been really good. He is tough in the ring, a bit spooky. So I definitely had some big spooks and airs, but um, the rest of it I think made up for that, and I thought it was judged too really fairly. I've noticed as we were talking before. I noticed he was a bit spooky today. Mm -hmm. I thought you rode him very well. He looks a little challenging yeah, in that too. regard. Yeah, yeah. He he got the spook. Normally I don't get the tension, and I did get a little bit of tension today from the spook and that. The ring's a little bit tough there and lots to work at, right, so right. But I'm still happy with him. Well, good. Mm -hmm. And it's his first advance, not yours, but his first advance. Yep. How have you walked the course? I did. I okay. looked at it last night. And how do you feel about it? Uh, it looks good. I think they've modified some of it. Um, we don't have, there's a little, one of the jumps that I was a bit worried about going down the hill, just him being strong and coming back. They've taken off the course. Um, it's definitely big and you know, I think he'll be a bit impressed, but he's been going really well, so I, I feel like he's ready. That's good. And Joe, what do you think about the course? Well, I think it, it's, I haven't ridden her advanced yet, and for me, I tend to start out slow, and then I finish well. So here, the, there's a couple jumps right at the beginning that are big questions, and they're not complicated, they're just big questions. Right. So I have to not be grandma, I have to be on it, and go gallop <laughs> and jump my jumps. <laughs> so for me, it's uh, it's my thing tomorrow, right. it's not Dee's. Right. And this course is has been known for being a little bit challenging. Why did you decide to move up here? Um, because it's just where, if I don't want to go travel 2,000 miles, it's where it comes up. Okay. So I had a good run at Rebecca Farm, okay. and I like supporting John's event. It's beautiful. The courses yeah. are beautifully built. And yeah. What do you think about the design of the, and the flow of the course? It's, it's, I, I think it's good. I think, like Jill said, it's big in the beginning, so you kind of have to come out and be on your game, and it never lets up anywhere, really. But I think it flows from some of the riders riding last year. It seemed to flow really well, and mm -hmm. but you have to come out a little bit and, then, and kind of attack those first mm -hmm. few fences so that they get on their roll. Right. For me, it's not flowing because of the terrain and the woods. Right. So right. it's not like jumping at Rebecca Farmer Galway or right. Twin Rivers or something. Right. Yeah, has to come, for me, it has to come from me. Sure, sure. Because I mean, she first, doesn't just... Go first there. couple jumps right off the bat are right. pretty big, mm -hmm. and then that second right. jump is pretty big. Right. And then you, it is, to me, walking it, it looks pretty twisty, right. turny. I mean, it, it kind of sort of backs on itself, and so right. I think that poses its own challenge. Well, thank you guys so much. Good luck tomorrow. I hope you have stellar performances again. Yeah, yeah. And I really appreciate it. We'll yep. be hope to talk to you again. I know. <laughs> thank you. Thank you.